Adam, what are you doing in here? I need to speak with Director Miller about my investigation. Thought maybe he was in the NSN. You? Same. Only just leaving him a message. It's about Vince Black, our organized crime division head. I'm worried. I was hoping maybe the director had heard from him. Black's still deep undercover inside the Diwali organization, isn't he? The kind of deep that can be hard to swim back from sometimes, yeah. He's supposed to meet with me once a week so I can bring him back into the shallows, only... He never showed for our first meeting. From what I know of the Diwali, their influence extends outside of the Czech Republic. Maybe he's out of town. Maybe. Maybe you could find out? Sure. I think I can do some digging around for you. When was the last time you heard from him? First and last time was in his office a few days ago. He seemed... antsy. Kind of nervous that I was there, you know? Well then, maybe I'll poke around his office a little while I'm here. Why well, stop now, right? Well, listen, Adam, Lyon's waiting on my initial batch of reports, and I'm sure Director Miller wouldn't be too pleased to find us standing in his office, so... Unless there's something else, I think this is where I'll check out. Alright. Well, I'll let you know if I find out anything about Black. Thanks. Delara, I'm in Vince's office. I think I have a lead. An appointment Vince made with an informant. That sounds promising, Adam. You willing to follow up? Only way to find out what happened to him. If something happened to him. Let's not assume the worst just yet. the NSN conversation we recovered. He agrees you two should meet. Good. Just tell me where. There's an abandoned tourist information center in the central plaza. Make sure you're not followed. And I got something on Marchenko for you, too. Details are on a pocket secretary near the meetup point. Look for a trash bin with a chalk mark above it. You'll find it near the metro. Got it. We are not having this conversation. for someone. You really think you should be saying my name out loud in a place like this? So it is you. Discretion. Right. I'm sorry. But it was your bright idea to meet here of all places. Not exactly the safest part of Prague to... <sighs> you didn't mention that you were augmented in your description. What difference does it make? None, I suppose. And... I don't mean to stare. It's just... It doesn't fit with your reputation. My reputation, huh? Man's not always aware of what people say about him. What else have you heard? People are wary of you. They say that you are everyone's enemy. Everyone's friend. They... They also say you are one of the few who has the courage to expose the Diwali for what they really are. But first, I need to know I can trust you. What kind of trouble are you in, exactly? You know exactly what kind of trouble I'm in. My husband, Ballista, he... The 
operation you've been digging into it. Come closer. Pretend you're kissing my neck. Your husband runs a Diwali operation. I'm assuming there are people in here who know who he is. You don't think me kissing his wife might draw unwanted attention? Flirting is one thing. They expect it. He cheats on me, I cheat on him. But his business is something else entirely. We must be discreet, darling. Please, I'll tell you whatever I can. Whatever you want. But not here. This isn't the time to ask questions. You understand, yes? You're not in any danger as long as we're together. Now how about you tell me a little more about your husband? I am in danger the longer we are together. What part of this do you not understand? I can protect you if it comes to that. I don't need you to protect me. Listen to me. I know what I'm doing. Now please. There is courage and there is suicide. We shouldn't be talking like this here. All right, where do you suggest we talk? <laughs> oh, darling, you are so sweet to say such things to me. <laughs> I can walk you out of here. You'll be fine. No, I don't want them to see us together. Please, I am leaving by train tonight. There is a secluded courtyard by the tracks in Chikashka. Go before me and I'll meet you there. I promise to give you whatever information you need. You sure you'll be all right until then? <laughs> I've survived marriage to that man for this long. I think I can make it one more night. I'll be okay. I just need another drink to get my courage up and to loosen my tongue. We'll see each other soon, I promise. What is it, Adam? Any word on what happened to Vince? I just spoke to his contact. A woman he was supposed to meet to get info on some Diwali op. Problem is, he never showed up. I have a really bad feeling about this. Do whatever you can, Adam, to pick up his trail. Let's hope he's alright. here to kill me. I mean, I know what kind of man my husband is, but to sit those animals on me? Oh, I tried to tell you inside the club. We needed to be more discreet. You sure he's the one who sent them? 
Who else? Blesta is not a good man. He smuggles weapons, drugs, whores, you name it. All of it heading east. Oh, it's obvious now that he knows that I know. I have the address of the locker where everything is stored, and I have the code to get in. You want me to shut down your husband's smuggling operation? I want you to uphold your part of the deal. I give you this information, and in exchange you pay for my ticket out of Prague. I must leave Vlasta tonight. I have no other choice now. I need to know a little more about who you've been talking to about me. Some of these things you say you've heard. The information must have come from somewhere. It... came mostly from Vlesta. There is no name my husband curses more often than yours. And my husband curses a lot. Sounds like your husband and I are great friends. I have to admit I was a little scared. I kept telling myself, my husband's enemy is my friend. But some of the things I overheard, they didn't exactly inspire confidence. But now that I've met you, I feel like they cannot be true. What kinds of things? The way his men talk about you. They say there is nothing you won't do, no one you won't betray, for the sake of your own agenda. When you asked me to meet you at the Red Queen, of all places, and then when I saw those men listening to our conversation, I... I don't know. I thought the worst, I suppose. I'm sorry to have doubted you. Given what happened with those men, the way they attacked us, seems like you're in even more danger than you thought. Don't worry. I will be careful. Just as you must be, darling. Besides, I'll be out of Prague within the hour, and Vlesta will never see me again. Assuming, of course, that you can pay. What else do I need to know about your husband? Vlesta is like all young Diwali. You cannot argue with them. You cannot intimidate them. You cannot appeal to their heart. All he cares about is delivering on time, and chasing after women who are not his wife. Is that why you want to get back at him? Because of something he's done to you? I... I have no illusions about who I married. I know he was... ambitious. Eager to please the wrong kinds of men. But I didn't think he would turn into this... this monster. I want him to test failure. To have to walk home with his tail between his legs. If I get involved in this, there's a chance he might not walk home at all. I wouldn't cry over him. Alright, this information you have, how much do you want for it? The price of a ticket to Berlin, with enough left over to start my new life. I believe that is what we agreed. They say Berlin is a good city for those wanting to be lost. Here, this should be enough to get you out of here. All right. Thank you. My husband owns a storage locker next to the Palisade Bank. The code is 2565. It is the centerpiece of his operation. I hope you find what you're looking for. Delara, the Diwali op Vince was digging into? I've got the address of a smuggling locker he was looking for. Ah, uh, maybe he's still looking. Or maybe he found it some other way. This information, you... came by it how, exactly? The informant Vince was supposed to meet. I told her I was Vince. Interesting. You never struck me as the pretending type, Adam. I always assumed what you see is what you get. I should have known better. Point is, I got a lead. I'll let you know what I find.
used to be a beautiful city. Now look. Vlasta sees you here. Waiting alone was part of the deal. Vlasta, huh? What kind of deal? Why are you locked up in here? I don't know who you are or what you want, but me getting out of here is non-negotiable. You need to leave. I got a tip about a Diwali smuggling operation being run through here. One that may or may not involve someone I'm looking for. And headed by your friend, Vlasta. <laughs> Vlasta is not my friend. He's... he's a necessary evil. Are you some kind of cop? I know all about cops. The ones I met in Gollum were very good at introducing themselves. I'm not like them. Look, I'm not from here. My name is Olivier. Five months ago, I was pulled from a train. I didn't have a ticket. They checked my name and saw that in university, years ago, I was part of a radical group. Fifty students, we were nothing. But it is enough for them to drag me into Golem. Since then, I have spent every minute of every day trying to get out. And now that I'm close, you are not going to ruin it for me. You're paying the Diwalis to be their cargo. There's got to be better ways of getting out of Prague. Not legal ones. Not for me. Blast has my best shot of getting past the checkpoints. I got the rest of the money and now he's going to get me all the way to Rabia. I am not going back to Golem. Do you have any idea how bad it is? I saw segregation in Gollum. Oppression, crime. But I also saw courage. People finding ways to keep going. I know it's bad. But I'm not sure it's worth making a deal with the devil just to get out. If you believe that, then you go live there. Spend five months getting kicked, spit on, locked up and interrogated about things you know nothing about. I'll take my chances with people like Vlasta, people like Vince. Vince? Vince Black? What's his role in all of this? He's the one I had to pay to get to Vlasta. You had to pay him where? When's the last time you saw him? Two days ago, the basement of a convenience store in Davni Obvut. It was not far from the gates. That, that is all I know, please. This is my ticket now, do you understand? Promise me. You can't ask me to ignore a Diwali smuggling ring. They're moving weapons around, helping to arm God knows who. Not my problem. Look, I never had another chance like this. I've given them everything I have for this one shot. If I get recaptured... It's Blaster. Look, nothing you do here can change the fact that the Diwalis move contraband through the city. It's what they do. It's something they'll always find a way to do. You stop this truck and others will still make it out. The only difference is that come on, come I won't on, be on any of them. Truck. I need to meet Katka at the club by nine. Katka might have to wait. Who sent you? I'm just here to see my friend off, make sure she's in good hands. As long as I have no reason to worry about all of you. You have no reason to worry about me. See her off? This look like an airport lounge to you? I didn't tell anyone. I swear. Whatever you're going to do, Vrasta, do it quick. I don't like surprises. When people break my terms, it makes me want to break things. Or maybe not break them, maybe strip them down. Sell them for parts. Olivier's already paid you for a safe trip out of here. Now I'm gonna tip extra, just to make sure she gets a smooth ride. Money talks, right? Always. All right, friend. But you need to leave right now. 
Do that, and everybody wins. Everybody wins when Olivia gets where she needs to go. I'm gonna follow up on her. If she doesn't make it to Rabia safely. Don't worry, she'll get there. First fucking class. Now leave. <clears throat> Thank you for that. It's been a long time since someone did me a favor. You're not out of the woods yet, I think you know that. I'm giving you a way to contact me, if anything goes wrong. Hey, lovebird, we're on a schedule. Let's wrap this up! I'll be fine. I promise. Here, I was saving this for when I got to Rabia, but I think you should have it. It's the least I can do. You've ruined it! My only chance! Unless you can get me to Rabia, I don't want to hear it. Murderers in uniform! Lara, I found Vince. You were right to have a bad feeling. What are you saying, Adam? Is he... Yeah. He should have been pulled months ago. It's all over his profile. Vince lost his edge. A person tries to be two things at once, sometimes he ends up not being either of them. He becomes lost. I'll take your word for it. I'm gonna let you be... Break this to Miller. Right. Of course. Be careful out there, Adam. Mm -hmm. 